Welcome to the Lakers News Today channel. Take the opportunity to leave that like and subscribe to the channel. Let's go to today's news. Hello. Recently, Lakers Nation. After representing Team USA at the Paris Olympics, Anthony Davis is back in full swing and is sure that he's more prepared than ever for the new NBA season. We know there's a lot of concern about his and LeBron James' health, especially after intense competitions like the Olympics. But contrary to what many might think, Davis believes the experience had a super positive effect. In an interview with ESPN on Media Day, he talked about how playing during the offseason gave him an edge. You're not shaking off the rust like you would if you hadn't played anything official. Competing at a high level leaves you more ready for the season. And the impact was already visible. In the first preseason game against the Phoenix Suns, even though he played only the first half, the duo of Davis and LeBron showed they were in great form scoring 36 of the team's 69 points by halftime. The truth is, AD's health has always been a delicate topic. Since his time with the Pelicans, he's dealt with several injuries that kept him off the court. But last season, he broke that streak, playing 76 of 83 possible games, including the NBA Cup Finals. That's an incredible number for a center with his history, especially considering that in his first four years with the Lakers, he averaged just 48.5 games per season. The Lakers know that to dream of a title, it's essential for Davis to stay healthy. And with him in top shape, along with LeBron, the team's chances of fighting for the top increase significantly. So, what do you all think? Will AD maintain this consistency and lead the Lakers toward the championship? I want to know your opinions in the comments. And look, if Anthony Davis manages to stay healthy throughout the season, we can expect great things from the Lakers. His presence not only strengthens our defense but also puts pressure on opponents with his offensive ability, both in the paint and with mid-range shots. When AD is at his best, the Lakers' game reaches another level. And with LeBron by his side, the combination of experience and skill is something that few teams can match. Another important point to highlight is the depth of this year's roster. We have new pieces and players who have already proven they can contribute significantly when called upon. The Lakers did a good job during the offseason, bringing in players who can take some of the physical load off Davis and LeBron, allowing them to focus on the more critical moments of the season. Now, the big challenge will be maintaining this intensity throughout the 82 games of the regular season and, of course, the playoffs. Everyone knows that with Davis in shape and LeBron healthy, the Lakers become a very tough team to stop. But the question remains, will the supporting cast be able to keep up the pace when the pressure mounts? Well, folks, the expectations are high, and the season promises. The preseason has already given us a glimpse of what's to come, but the real battle starts now. I want to hear from you. What are your predictions for AD and LeBron's performance? And how do you see the impact of the new additions to the team? Leave your comments below, and don't forget to subscribe to the channel so you don't miss any updates on our Lakers. Now, thinking long-term, the big question is how the Lakers will manage Anthony Davis and LeBron James' workload throughout the regular season. We know durability has been a challenge in recent years, and the franchise will need to be careful to avoid unnecessary where before the playoffs. Smart rotations and the use of new reinforcements will be crucial to ensure that these two icons reach the decisive moments in full shape. Speaking of reinforcements, the addition of young talents and experienced veterans to the roster promises to balance the team in a way we haven't seen in a while. Players like Roy Hakimura, Austin Reeves, and Gabe Vincent, who shown in last year's playoffs, now have the opportunity to grow even more and contribute directly to the team's success. With a more balanced rotation, the Lakers can better manage the playing time of their stars, avoiding overloading Davis and LeBron. What excites me the most is the competitive spirit AD brought back from the Olympics. He seems to be in a mentally and physically confident place, something that can be decisive for his consistency throughout the season. If he can maintain that energy and intensity, we could see an Anthony Davis dominating on both offense and defense, being a true MVP candidate. And speaking of MVP, can you imagine what it would be like to see LeBron and AD competing for that title side by side while leading the Lakers toward the finals? It's a possible dream, folks. But of course, everything will depend on how the team gels and how the new players absorb their roles in the game plan. So, my friends, everything is set for a season that promises to be one of the most exciting in recent years. Now it's your turn. What are your expectations for the Lakers this season? Will we see a dominant Anthony Davis all year long? What can we expect from LeBron James and the integration of the new reinforcements? Comment below and share your opinions.
And of course, don't forget to subscribe to the channel and hit the notification bell to stay updated on everything going on with our Lakers. As a Lakers fan, I'm excited and optimistic about this new season. Seeing Anthony Davis coming back from the Olympics so energized is a relief, especially because his health has always been a concern. If he really manages to keep up the pace and avoid injuries, we might be looking at one of his best seasons in a Lakers jersey. What excites me even more is the balance the team is building. The front office did a great job in the offseason by bringing in players who can consistently contribute, allowing LeBron and AD not to have to carry all the weight alone. I think that's the key to success this season, managing our stars' minutes well and giving space for the younger players to grow. Honestly, I think the rotation will be fundamental. Players like Austin Reeves and Rue Hakimura have already shown what they're capable of, and I expect to see even more growth from them. If the team can find a good rhythm early on, we can be very competitive, even against the powerhouses of the West. However, the decisive factor will be the health of AD and LeBron. They need to be fully fit for the playoffs because that's where everything will be decided. And with Anthony Davis playing at his best, I believe we have a real chance of fighting for the title. The combination of a healthy and dominant AD with LeBron's leadership makes the Lakers a team that no one can underestimate.